a lost and find Ended the game in overtime Drawing of a new design Drilling that one earth of mind Looking to the outward Speaking mind about words Absurd Blurred to the curb Walking along the verge Hey everybody, what is happening? Isha Laish and it is Madden 18 season. Uh, jumping on real quick, I've got you know the EA access. Uh, what you got your 10 hours here? I figured I would just get on real quick, uh, get you know just a handful of packs. Uh, see if I can get at least that base team, that bottom team built up. And of course, you know when you load up, they make you they make you jump through a couple hoops here before you can even do that quick solo. But that's okay. Um, I started off with, of course, the Cardinals book. I, I'm probably just for the sake of doing something different. Uh, we'll run, you know, who knows what I'm going to run here. But I noticed with this book, it was actually very similar to the previous, you know, in 17 and the previous ones. Although I've already heard that, you know, there are a lot of books like Rams and, and stuff like that that have been changed a lot. So I could probably spend easily all of my EA access time just going through playbooks to find what I want to run and all that. But, you know, I'll give it a little bit of time there. I'll probably go through, uh, you know, and, and do some solos and stuff like that here as I get caught up. But, you know, and once we figure out, you know, how the defense is going to play, where the weaknesses are and all that, you know, then I'll look into the offensive stuff. Um, you know, and early on, you know, well, this is just the arcade mode. You see um, some odd animations at times here. This guy just, just chucking everybody to the ground. But I guess that's what's going to happen in the arcade mode. Uh, you know that that you know to be expected from what I hear, but you know I'm even though I'm like the simulation stuff. I just I gear everything I do towards the head to head. I think that's where it's at. But you know let's say real quick we we're just looking at that. But um, now we'll go go jump in. Um, we'll get the uh, packs in and they had a bundle out here, which is the, what a twelve thousand point bundle. We're gonna be looking at. Um, yeah, so it's like 90 bucks right there. I'm not going to spend 90 bucks to start the game off, but we'll get about $30 worth of these um, packs here, these gold player bundles. They're 600 and then they get the premium packs, 300 I, I haven't been paying attention to what people are opening, but again, just given the start of the game, there's no reason to dump that much money into it. So uh, we got 16 of these here, and we get a reward pack here. Let's get this out of the way, see what we're going to get. Um, okay, this is just going to be tickets, which uh, sounds like we'll go through these a lot more this year than last. Um, the, at least, I mean, there's just a lot of options this season here and some fun co-op stuff. So it should at least uh, bring more entertainment, I would think, to uh, YouTube and, and channels and stuff like that. But getting into the packs here, I guess um, you know, it'll be take a bit getting used to having these small packs, right? Because no, no bronzes, no coaches, playbooks, any of that sort of stuff in here. Um, and, and I forgot to mention here, just on early reports from I've heard from a couple people, and I didn't get a chance to run it yet, but it sounds like a lot of the blitz stuff that we did last year in that nickel 335 wide is working. It's working here out of the gates in this. Um, I haven't done it myself, but I've heard from a few different people now that that stuff is actually going to hold up. So if you're not familiar with that, you can actually go back to my uh, Madden 17 stuff and at least get yourself a head start on, on some defensive uh, tips, tricks, and stuff like that, setups. Um, okay, so uh, these packs here, I don't know what these ones were, the two two golds guaranteed per or whatever we're looking at, I guess, Adam. And then, uh, you know, if you get lucky, hit something out of that. I'm not sure really what the rates that everybody else are pulling elites out here so far. I'm not seeing anything, but um, in the flashes, take kind of a second. You know what I noticed when I was looking at them, like, all right, that's how they're going to play that kind of leave a little suspense even when it's a silver one but y'all get we'll get used to all that and all the new gimmicks of, of the year um you know i'm kind of curious to see what took them so long to get a lot of gameplay out i believe that there are going to be uh, you know some glitches and stuff like that obviously I knew there's going to be problems here with the start because it's, especially with the new system i mean it you know um i hear the fumbling stuff that they talk so much about is not working uh, people are still standing around acting really silly. I've seen a lot of odd animations already um, just off of like interceptions standing up and really, you know, stuff that needs to be cleaned up. But again, I, to me, is expected. Get a Teddy Bridgewater 78. And so far, I'm not liking these packs. I mean, that is me, obviously, if you're not getting any red. And this year, I would have figured you would have a higher chance to pull because the way that everything's lowered and brought down. And I'm hoping the game just isn't going to be, you know, 
played really slow once you get a feel for all the stuff. Uh, it, but at least it, I did hear that they are, um, you know, with the juke and the spin moves, are brought back at least. Hey, and we finally hit an elite. We're going to get Jeremy Hill uh, running back. I think running back was one of the cards I could expect um, with the four net, I believe. I don't, you know, we'll see how that goes when that comes out. But we'll take a look at here at the back since I it's the only one I've pulled. Uh, Okay, I mean, probably a little bit more speed than I thought just since they were nerfing all that sort of stuff. Uh, it could be decent uh, built up. And you see, excuse me, guys, I'm not totally caught up on how these cards will be upgraded and all that. I'll get right back into it, but when I took off for the last couple of months, man, I did as much as I can just to step back so I can come and refresh this year. Um, <laughs> and uh, unfortunately, these guys, uh, you know, with, with the packs at least here, one out of the, one out of the eight, so... Um, let's see if we can catch at least something on the back end. Yeah, seven left on this one. Um, but a worst case scenario, the way I figure, is at least you're going to come in and you'll end up at least, I'll at least have a, a almost a full uh, team of golds built up doing it, you know, with, with uh, you know, this. So it's at least that's a good starter on that. And I think they have some um, of the solos that actually want you to have a lower overall. But you can always take cards out of lineup and stuff like that afterwards we all know that you know the tricks of the game I'm sure a lot of the stuff will be similar there um, we'll just have to see I haven't really heard much on trade block hopefully you know there was a lot of rumors over the summer about that but um, I don't I don't know where what that what that's gonna consist is that they're gonna leave that open hopefully there's nothing messed up with that I hate to see any negativity floating around any any part of the game um, but you know we will see we'll see how it goes here it's gonna be a crazy start um, I will be looking out also guys if I can I mean never guaranteed last two years though I was able to get a handful of those Dorito codes in I will be looking here in the next week to, to pick up as many as I can I've only obviously need a couple for me my brother and, and such so anything extra I will be giving out in the videos but um, you know we'll just keep an ear out if I say that I have them I'll put them in and pretty much whoever catches them in the videos gets them but um, you know, like I say, if I come across a bunch of them, I, I'll, I'll buy them and snag them all up and then hand out what I can. So hopefully uh, we'll get three years in a row at least of, of finding them before they sell out. And ooh, I mean, the back, I mean, I, I don't know. I don't know what to be happy with as far as golds here. I mean, I'm just, you know, we're all trained not to. So even if I'm getting 74, 75, 76, like that's all, it, you know, nothing to be excited about, especially putting money into it. But we'll see here. I mean, um, I, I will probably again look into getting whatever the opening day packs and stuff but you know early on it's more about kind of getting solos and stuff that they give you the free cards and and in there if i did pull anything high i mean i'll end up selling probably that jeremy hill even i don't really have a use for it i'd rather start this year with the mindset of probably more like trying to build up a coin stack as the year goes through uh, and, you know who knows how heavy they're going to hit us with um as far as the the uh, nat players the no auction no trade sort of cards you can probably expect a lot this year also so it's kind of going to be we'll have to get an idea about how um you know that's going to balance out as far as uh, coins go i seems like they would like to limit farming but there's only so much you can do you know uh, so <laughs> we're, we're getting here now to the end, and it's just uh, unfortunately for this opening, guys. We're just, I'm getting skunked all the way around. Um, one one elite, you know. We're gonna drop, like I say, drop about thirty dollars worth of packs. Uh, you know, it's all said and done. Uh, get just some of these little uh, 300 ones also, just to mix it up. But not very impressed, unfortunately. Hopefully, it'll pick up again here um, the the next day round, which will probably. Like I said, probably be uh, on the day the game drops, whatever. If they have any cool bundles, then I'll look at another one of the, uh, you know, the little mini mid-size. Maybe, perhaps, we'll see how it goes. Um, you know, if I actually score one of the free copies of the game, then I might be looking to put a little bit more money into the front of the season also. That's kind of some of that hinging on that. But, unfortunately, EA is just really waiting on these, like, mutt rewards information and stuff like that till the very end. I don't know why i mean it's, it looks like bad promoting guys but hey there's kevin white 75 <laughs> but uh you know I, I don't know i don't know what it is if they're just trying to hide some things or whatever it is or if, say, if it's a something to do with marketing that way i'm hoping people will just pre-order more not knowing what's going on but that's real quick here we'll generate the best lineup so uh see you know i can't really say it's necessarily money well spent we get one elite out of all that really I mean, I, uh, you know, that's uh, not, not a great way to start the season, but 
it's what it is. Uh, we're gonna keep on grinding anyway. That's the team. Um, like I say, I'm gonna uh, try and figure out, get into some uh, formations here as I uh, get EA access. Thanks for checking this out, guys. Later.